Wild Star is a new double fire grenade launcher added to Destiny 2, and it's only the second version of this weapon that's been added into the game. Well, this is available by completing Nightfall Strikes, so compared to a dungeon for the first double fire grenade launcher. Plus, this one is solar, and it's going to go really, really well with your solar builds. Well, today, I want to take a close look at the weapon, the stats, the perks, the girls to chase, plus also how to get Wild Style in Destiny 2. Okay, without further delay, let's dive right in. So, how to get Wild Style. So, to get this one, you have to complete Nightfall Strikes, and it's a random reward that drops when you complete the mission. So, to improve your chances, complete higher level Nightfall Strikes, either Legend, Master, or Grandmaster. Wild Style will be a featured Nightfall weapon for the whole week. So you can check out when the Nightfall weapon is available by subscribing to Endgame Express and never missing a weekly reset update. Once you've had it dropped for you, you can also get it from Zavala in the tower. Next up, let's have a closer look at Wild Style. So it's a legendary energy grenade launcher. It's a double fire grenade launcher, meaning it is a hard hitting twin fire round launcher. And looking at the stats, you've got a blast radius of 60, 90 for velocity, 27 for stability, 48 for handling, 39 for reload speed, 4 for airborne effectiveness. It's a 100 rounds per minute grenade launcher with one in the magazine. Well, for this one, we've got a choice of origin traits. So we've got Vanguard's Vindication. Final blows of the weapon grant a small amount of health. We've got Stunning Recovery. Stunning a champion partially refills your magazine, triggers health regeneration, and improves recovery for a short duration. And you've also got Tech's Balance Stock, so damaging targets while firing from the hip. Increases handling, reload speed, and movement speed whilst aiming down the sights. Well, next up, let's have a look at the Wild Style God Roll Guides. So, for PvE, Quick Launch, Spike Grenades, Envious Assassin, and Incandescent would be good. So, Quick Launch greatly increases the handling speed and increases the projectile speed too. Then you've got Spike Grenades, so that increases the stability. Envious Assassin, that is where defeating targets with other weapons before drawing this one transfers ammo to the magazine from reserves. And this effect can overflow the magazine based on the number of targets defeated. Then you've got Incandescent, so defeating a target spreads Scorch to those nearby. And more powerful combatants and opposing guardians cause Scorch in a larger radius. I would go with Vanguard's Vindication for PvE. And also, you want a Reload Speed Masterwork. For PvP, on the other hand, Quick Launch, Proximity Grenades, Enlightened Action and Incandescent would be good. So we've been through Quick Launch and also Incandescent. So let's have a look at the differences. So proximity grenades. Grenades fired from this weapon have an increased proximity detection, but a decreased blast radius. So that is useful in PvP. And then we've got enlightened action. So dealing damage improves the reload speed and the handling. Always good. Always good on a grenade launcher in the Crucible. Well, let me know in the comments what you think about Wild Style. This one is a new weapon added in this mid-season patch in this very long season that we're going through at the moment. But let me know down in the comments what you think about Wildstyle. It's also the first double fire grenade launcher available outside of a dungeon. So this one should be good for a lot of people to pick up and it'd be really good to know what you think about it. So let me know down there in the comments. Well, that is it for this guide for how to get Wildstyle in Destiny 2. And as always, thank you so much for watching or for listening. Don't forget you can subscribe to Endgame Express by hitting that subscribe button down below. You can also hit that like button and that share button too. It would really, really help us out here on the channel. Well, thanks again. I'll see you soon.